there can be many ways of, 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 of defining uh, transformative uh, learning. For me is, you know, how you can translate the idea or the knowledge or the values to your life and implement your life and practice it. And through that, the first, the impact is like transforming your own life. You know, the transforming own, your own life, but transforming your body, transforming your mind, transforming your heart. For example, if we say the compassion, practice compassion, oh, compassion, empathy, and compassion is a great idea, you know, but we cannot learn empathy and compassion where we learn how to uh, oper uh, uh, operate computer. It's a very different procedure. It's a very different uh, way of learning. What I, I, I think maybe the, the, the neuroscientists, they call up the, there's a two kinds of learning, the procedural learning and declarative learning. The procedural learning is when we talk about transformative learning, it's we have to cultivate those quality through integrating and implementing, putting into practice. We could learn about compassion reading book, but we will we can only learn about compassion. But it's, it won't make us necessarily compassionate person. We can learn about patience reading a book or listening to the music, uh, listening to the lecture. Sorry, but that won't necessarily make us patient person. We will know about the patients. But transformative learning for me is, of course, number first, that you listen, you, uh, you experience, and you, you, you observe. And the second stage is where you have to reflect. The real transformating, le transformative learning happens through the self-reflection. It's never through listen. We do not learn we, can, we do not, cannot learn transformative learning from just listening and observe unless and until we reflect on what information we receive and what we learn from the book. So the reflection is a key for the transformative learning. So as a leader, I think, well, we all are, I'm not talking about leader means like you're leading hundred or thousand people. We all are leader. We are leader for our children. We are leader for our family. We are leader for our friends. And our, we have a big responsibility of leading our life through examples because we all love our loved ones, our friends. We wish them a best, but best way to actually wish is to transform our own life and lead by example. So we cannot bring the best uh, in other persons. We cannot bring the best in uh, uh, others unless and until we bring the best in ourselves. So the transformative learning is uh, something that we need to, uh, uh, we need to, we need to uh, apply. So for example, I, 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 uh, one thing that I, I tell the children in my community is, you know, there is a three ways of smiling because when we get up, it's nice to see somebody smiling at you. It is a very inexpensive, but very, very powerful and precious thing that you can dream of sometimes. Somebody, we all love people looking at us with a smile. We, we all wish. But can we really learn from smile from heart and mind and body? This is something I feel so important. You know, these three tools, these three energies, if we know how to harmonize, align these three energy, it becomes the simple smile becomes sometimes one of the most, most powerful just imagine as a business people that we invest hundreds and thousands of dollars to buy a device or software and we don't use them properly. Of course, the boss is gonna scream. This is a waste of investment. We spend so much money to buy this software, 
and this devices. See, now we are not, most people are not using it. But can, you, can we think that we have this amazing three tools, heart, mind, and body? How often we think it, even as a business, Yes, when we go get ready to go job, of course, we will take shower, we will brush, we don't want to stink, we will put nice shirt, pants, we will coordinate color coordination, best you want to look, you want to present the best of uh, the best version of you. And then the true best is hidden inside those suit, those pants and clothes, people can see that moment you wear the expensive suit you go if your three tools the energy heart mind and body is not aligned then people can see through that it doesn't matter even you wear the expensive suit even you wear a simple kurta pajama but your three tools of body heart minds are really well harmonized they are aligned and when you smile, you can smile from your heart. You could see your body, your face smile, and your, you can smile from heart, mind, and body. And that can be such, such a powerful uh, way, 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 way of, uh, uh, way of uh, smiling. Now, uh, Professor